every time I wear this, people say, you smell good. Mm, baby, I do. Mm. YouTube, it's the real J Doll here on the Real J Doll's channel. I am getting ready to go on a weekend trip with my friends. We're taking a road trip down to Louisville for my friend's birthday, and we're gonna have like a nice little weekend trip. So it's already four o'clock, and guess who hasn't packed anything? You guessed it. The suitcase behind me <laughs> is empty. So I think she has left already and it's gonna take her about an hour and a half to get to me so let's go ahead and try and pack for this trip within an hour i don't know how i'm gonna do this because we literally have no itinerary and when you don't have an itinerary you don't know the vibes i'm sure we're probably gonna go to brunch sure we're probably gonna go on some kind of tour or some i don't know so i have to pick outfits that are like kind of neutral but i'm still trying to get tough but i'm still trying to give you know what i need to give the girls so I'm in my work clothes right now. This is my work outfit. And I need to change into what I'm gonna be wearing on the road. I think I already have an idea for that. Let's go ahead and get into this. We've got pretty much an hour, I guess, to get done what we need to get done. So let's get started. All it. right, so I don't think you guys have ever been to my room before since I've moved. Trust me, it's not much to see, it's pretty plain. Whenever I get finished decorating it, then I'll show you guys, but okay. Let's think about it. We're gonna be in the car, so we wanna go with something smooth, neutral, it's kinda cold outside, so we gotta think about that. I'm thinking black bodysuit, black vest, maybe a black hoodie underneath the vest, and then black shoes. First of all, you can never go wrong with a black on black. This is a black dress, definitely not. Okay, okay, this is a black bodysuit, but this has no sleeves, so. You wanna try and get one with sleeves. It's hard pulling out black from a drawer because like everything black just seems like it's colliding together. No, this is a turtleneck. I know I have one. It's frustrating. Hold on, let me go downstairs. Okay, I actually did wash these clothes. They were just sitting down there waiting to be folded. Ooh. Okay, we've out of breath already. Like what? So I got this black bodysuit, long sleeves, cause it's cold outside. It's like gonna be 30, 40 degrees this weekend. And this came from Shein, and I got in a size small. So let me try to start. This is what we're looking like. I like it. It's very simple. The hoodie is downstairs, but. I'm not gonna put that on right now because I'm moving around a lot around the house. Actually, I'm about to take this off because I'm gonna work up a sweat. That reminds me, let me go put some deodorant on because your girl does not have time to be in the car musty. Imagine being that one musty friend in the car and y'all gotta sit together for two hours. Sickening. Currently, I use Secret. Ooh. Oh gosh. The worst thing is when you put on deodorant and then it gets in your clothes, but it's a little bit, but I think we're all good. But, ooh. <laughs> I am to the end of the life of this thing. But I don't even like Secret like that anymore. I feel like my body's starting to get used to it. Um, or maybe they're changing the formula because I know they're doing a lot of pH balancing, non-aluminum, you know, all that. So tell me what's your go-to deodorant because I'm looking to try one. Deodorant attached. Now... Look at the mess we made. Like what? So I have to clean this real quick because I would not be able to focus if all this is just on my bed. Let's fold these clothes. Hey Siri, play suit and tie by Justin Timberlake.
<laughs> we are moving today because guess what? This suit and tie song is, well, hold on. Let me show y'all the proof first. It took me three minutes and 40 seconds to fold all them clothes. I ain't never moved fast like that before. Okay. Hold on, let me check my phone. Let me check my phone just to make sure. All right, so let's go ahead and get our outfits for the actual trip planned out. So we've got my trusty suitcase. This is like the carry-on size at the airport. And this is like my little small baby for weekend trips or you know, a little here and there. I like to pick my clothes before I pick my undergarments because if you don't know what clothes you're wearing, you don't know what undergarments to pack. Let's go to my closet. Come on. The thing I love about my house is you thought this was just a mirror, baby. Ooh, it's a closet. If you watched my moving vlogs, you would know that, but come on. Um, actually I need a minute to think because um, it's hard to concentrate with y'all watching me. Okay, 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 time check. 509. I think we're doing pretty good because guess who has their outfits? Me, outfit review. Hold on, let me bring the camera down just a little bit. Okay, outfit review. We have this sweater. Y'all, this is like really nice, a little pop of color. So everything that I'm wearing this weekend is going to be black based because I have my small suitcase. So that means I can only bring probably one extra pair of shoes, maybe two if I was really trying, but one extra pair of shoes. So I have this like big oversized sweater. It is really cute and I love it. I got this from Shein. Half my clothes from Shein because back in the day when I used to, I see it, girl. Then I have these black leather skinny pants. I know they look like they're high waters, but trust me, this is just how tall my legs are. <laughs> this is literally how long my legs are. Outfit number two, I really like this. This is like a cropped, almost like, you know, it reminds you of like fall, like farmer. What are those things called? Scarecrow. So it has like fringe on the sleeves on the neckline and around the waist. And then you can wear this like either over the shoulder or you could just wear it like flat. So I like this, but it's not too cropped. Like it's really not cropped at all. My stomach area is right here anyway. So I got this to wear with, you guessed it, <laughs> black jeans. So these also came from Shein. Again, they may look short, but that's just how tall I am. And then they have a rip at the knee and that's it they got a little fringe here at the end but i'm gonna be wearing them with boots so my ankles won't be out it's gonna be cold like i told you guys so we're trying to keep warm i got a black belt this is just like a regular schmegular black belt from the hair store outfit number three i have this black turtleneck this actually didn't even come from Shein. <laughs> this came from hot kiss I don't know where that came from. This sounds like one of them like Burlington brands, you know, they be having everything. And then I have this jacket. This is a corduroy. It was there at one point in my life where I really like loved corduroy. And so I'm gonna bring this back for the weekend because I think we're gonna do like a little bourbon tour or something. So I feel like, you know, if I take a picture with this with the little barrels behind me, you know, I think this will be cute. So I have this and then I also have khaki pants. These take me back to elementary school days because um, I used to go to school and I used to wear uniform. So this is a throwback. I could have sworn this had a hole in it when I was like pulling on my pants one day where my fingers ripped it, I think. But um, I think it's actually good. I don't think it has a hole. Or maybe I just can't see it now, I don't know. So, those are the three outfits for the weekend. And then let me show you my outfit to wear back. On the way back, I am just going to wear this matching set from Fashion Nova, and it's just like a sweatsuit. And again, I could wear this with black and then like a little black t-shirt, tank, whatever underneath. On the way back, so those are the outfits. Let's put them in a the suitcase and then see what kind of space you work with.
Okay, the clothes are packed. Time to get the undergarments together. <laughs> My friend, y'all, look what even said. On the way to Cincinnati, get Jay-Z first, Bernie next. It like, oh my gosh, that was at 5.16, so that was four minutes ago. She lives like 45 minutes away from me, so that's literally like 30 minutes away. I need to be ready. Okay, so I can't play. Okay, um, uh, e ETA, question mark. Estimated time. Oh, this battery's about to die too. There's no way. There's absolutely no way. All right, well, undergarments. I'm not wearing anything tight. So I'm going to bring an extra brassiere. I'm going to bring four pair of undies. One, two, three, four, because you never know. And I'm going to bring a sports bra to sleep in. Three pair of socks. Um, I have a tan pair of socks, so you know, pop out the boot, give it a little color. And then I have this gray pair of socks. These are longer and I don't know what I'll wear that with. Maybe I'll wear this today. So I can have a little pop of gray. Ooh, do it on the floor. And then, okay, so that means I need another pair of socks. Okay, so then I have these fuzzy socks. I always like to bring at least one pair of fuzzy socks on whatever trip I go to because they're like my house shoes pretty much. So let me get another pair of socks. Gonna bring some black socks. All of my black socks are Nike Elite socks. Let's put these in here. Unfortunately, I will have to smash my bra, kind of, but whatever. And <gasps> pajamas, pajamas, pajamas. Nothing cute today for pajamas, just basic. I have my graduation shirt from school, and then I just have some gray pants or gray shorts from. Where did I get these from? H&M. And this belt is actually throwing it all off. Let's see, can it fit? Ooh, it's gonna be close. Okay. It fits, so it ships. It fits, it ships. Okay. Next, uh, toiletries, my favorite part. Let's go downstairs. Welcome to my beauty bathroom. I do all of my hair content, all of my makeup content down here in this room. <laughs> okay, but no, for real, gotta get serious. So we're in my beauty bathroom and it's time to pack my bag. So first I'm gonna start off with my makeup. Um, here is my makeup bag. This I got off Amazon. This is not real Louis Vuitton at all. And I think I'm starting to get sick of it because at first I was like, oh, like designer inspired. Like, let me get it. It'll help. I don't know, me feel a little better. But now it's like mm, designer inspired. So I don't know. I don't know. I really want to change this, but that's not the topic of today's discussion. We're trying to pack it. So in here already, first of all, let me take this out. In here already, I have my Bath & Body Works like travel size items. I have Into the Night lotion, and then I have the Into the Night spray. Dang, where is the label? Oh, oh. it used to be right here, y'all, look. <laughs> Definitely wiped it off, but Into the Night is one of my top Bath & Body Works scents. So I've got that in the bag and let's go ahead and pack the makeup. Here is my makeup box. I got this like a couple years ago for Christmas. This is my favorite. Actually, let me put a little blush on now. Mm-hmm. And throw that right in the bag. This weekend, I do not plan on doing like a face face at all. I'm just gonna do like my basic everyday makeup, which I have on right now. Just do a little bit of eyes, concealer, a little mascara, and we call it a day. We're not doing too much on this trip. So for my eyes, I use three things. Actually four things, actually five things. Hold on, I use a lot of things, not really. I actually have a beginner friendly makeup tutorial on my channel, just posted like maybe a couple weeks ago. So you can check that for the full, full, but this is like half of that. So first I'll go in with the eyebrow pencil to fill in my eyebrows and then I will go in with concealer. These are the two concealers I use on a quick day, the LA Pro and then the e.l.f. And then after that, 
them in the bag. After that, I'll go in with my True Complexion Contour Palette and then a brush for like my little, my little um, eyeshadow. I have to like do my routine in my mind so that way I make sure I pack everything. That's a good way to make sure you don't forget everything. Oh, I need a beauty blender because I need that to actually blend in the contour. And I think that's it. Yeah. Okay. For some reason, it seems kind of short. I use Maybelline mascara. I still haven't found a new mascara yet, but that's the mascara I use now. And then I have a black pencil that I go with like with my under eye make my eyes pop a little bit more and yeah that's it for makeup definitely need some hair mousse for this wig um you guys know my hair isn't this long but hair mousse it's like an easy lightweight way to keep your curls under control y'all i've actually had this wig for like maybe four years now and it's still in great condition granted i don't wear it every day like some people like i'll usually put it on for like this a little weekend or maybe like a little one two days my hair changes all the time but I've had this for like four years. Great quality. I know you see back in the mirror. The curls. Yeah. My bonnet is down here as well from this morning. So I'm going to put that in there. And then lastly for my hair, I'm going to bring a spray bottle. Just an empty spray bottle because I'll fill it with water. And then spray my hair just to re-wet it and get those curls like revived after that time. So yeah, that's it. That's it. That's it. Come on. We got to go because uh, what time is it? <gasps> 535! Buh! No! The light balance in this video is really killing me because all the rooms that I have in my house, like the light is just totally different. I recently got this as a Christmas gift. This is actually like a Rihanna fragrance and I didn't even ask for this, but I got it. And every time I wear this, people say, you smell good. Mm, baby, I do. <laughs> this is actually good. I don't even know the name. Rebel Heart maybe? But it's by Rihanna, I know that. And it's a Oue de Parfume Spray. I'm about to put this on right now. But I think, yeah. I think this is the scent of the weekend. I only put on three squirts and that's really all you need. That might have been too much because I don't want to be loud in the car. And what if it's other perfumes in the car? The worst thing to do is take a road trip with some girls and everybody has their own smell in there. So you're smelling like the little perfume store and that's just nasty. Let's finish this bag. Next, we need to get the day to day. So first we're gonna start off by packing my face wash. Um, I use Dr. Bronner's and then I just put that in a travel size case. Then I'm going to use my Black Girl sunscreen, SPF 30. The SPF 45 I used and it doesn't spread as, it doesn't spread as well across my face. So SPF 30, I'm gonna bring some extra contacts glasses because y'all when i <laughs> when i went to dubai y'all tell me i was in dubai and i got my eye wash in my eyes and i didn't even bring my glasses i don't think so i was so sad travel toothbrush clean that breath baby i already have toothpaste in here as well actually i have the crest Pro Health Advance gum protection. This is the travel size that I get when I go to the dentist, so that's it there. Makeup wipes. All I have in here is secret deodorant, like. I'm about to show you all. Cause that's all my job gives me, is secret. Like, everything don't have to be a secret. Aluminum free, you know, it's supposed to be healthy. 24 hour odor protection, a little free as well. I think I used this one before and sister was free of so much stuff. It was free of the stuff that was protecting me. So, I'm gonna try this one. Zero baking soda dye, it's talc. Hey, put this in the bag. So the next thing I need to pack are my boots. Either I should wear my heel booties or just my like black commando style boots. One, two, three. Went with the heel booties and these are kind of like commando too. I got these from Burlington and they're super cute. So that's gonna go in the bag. I need to get a 
Kroger bag for that. And then my bag for the weekend is this cute little book bag. Also came from Shein. I told you, my whole closet is just Shein. Have it on like this and carry it. It's gonna be cute. Okay, so the suitcase is packed. It just needs to be closed. Look at that. Woo. All right. That was definitely too hard. I am about to wash the dishes and do whatever other cleaning I can do within these next however many minutes I have until they get here. It's an hour with my phone. I try to leave my phone on the charger so it can charge by the time she gets here, but she said one hour and, okay. That was at 521 and it's literally six o'clock on the dot. So I have 20 minutes and she could have said an hour just rounding, so. I got a few dishes I'm finna wash. And then I have my little vest here, boots in the closet, keys, like all that's done. So thanks for keeping me company. How unfair would it be for me to be packing with you guys for a weekend trip and not show you any of the weekend trips. So here are a couple clips from the weekend. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you're not subscribed, what are you doing? <laughs>